Welcome to episode 44. This is the Old Town Rovers Road to Glory, and we are about to kick off the first game of the episode, the first of four games. Um, what happened that is a good, it's a really good thing, is that EA finally fixed the broken game when it comes to glitch players. Now my academy is not containing players without name and numbers and skinny arms. It's just normal now with so they finally fix it. The sad thing is that I've already sold three or four of the potential to be special, you know, players that could end up above the 90s. So yeah. But it's fixed at least. So I don't have to worry about that. So I can start trying to use academy players even though we are now in the championship and we get players that are like in their mid 50s maybe mid 60s if we're lucky and the players in our team are in their mid 70s almost so you know it's going to take a while for us to, to get players that can actually play for us but i guess I, I'm, if i get decent players and i can just send them out on loan and hope that they develop there and, and you know now it's actually it's back to how it's supposed to be not me going to to scan the the free agency and look for new players uh, that's not what I want to do. That's not the youth addition at all. Uh, you know, I usually have the rule you have one free agent a season. But since of the glitch, I couldn't do that. I couldn't get any players. So I had to get everything from the free agency. Now we're going to go back to the how it's supposed to be, I guess. Meaning that we will stick with these guys for now. And uh, I've... I've Transfer listed quite a few. I have 42 players right now in my squad because I brought up a lot and I sold a few, but I have also transfer listed glitch players that are no longer glitch that I now have changed to, to um, being on loan instead. You know, I can send out and hope they grow. That's that's what I can do right now. So we're gonna have a big squad and it's gonna be a probably a lot of problems with that. But you know what are you gonna do? Anyway, let's focus on the Charlton game. We're going to play at the Valley. Uh, overcast is, is the, the forecast. And let's head right into the game. Let's see if we can shake them. Let's see if our adventure in the championship can actually be a good one. Buckle up. Let's go. So we will have the kickoff and the game starts. Right? Come on, boys. Taylor, he gets by. Oh. I'm not sure if they dive or if they actually get tackled sometimes. <coughs> it just hurts my soul when they do that. Nice, nice, day. thank you. So we have the old car, and I guess that's the la late nasty challenge that we saw before. We'll put other. This one. He should have stood. I'm not gonna be like that. But he should have stood up, you know. No reason to call that. Come on, he can do it, come on, Taylor. Take the shot for you. That's a nice different save now. Why it's a save? Let's see the replay. I'm not sure what the keeper's doing here. He's adding some drama to it. Over it comes. Birmingham game, Alex Scott. Up and, and you know, getting a chance to release that, that good shot that he had. Do you want the ball? Yep, we do. Beautiful. Parking makes a run. Nice. Leon is just standing there, but we can't find him. Find a hunter block. Taking a shot with Dwarf. Coming in across and getting a ball. It's tight. We, we don't get any clear chance, you know? Oh, come on. 
We have a weird cross to Okoye, who is just standing there, just directing the ball into the far post and into the goal. That's nice. But the cross was, there was no power. Look at the replay. There's no power at all. And he just uses hair to score. Love that. Yeah, it's enough. It's enough. It doesn't have to be harder than that. It's enough. We are a goal up. So we are a goal up. Late. Not, not that late in the second half, but we are still in the in the 60th minute, 61st minute right now. So that goal was good. Let's hope that we can just not prevent them from scoring immediately because they usually have that thing where they <coughs> almost get momentum when we have scored. Exact second he was about to pass the ball. That was a beautiful defensive move from the opponents. Well, so he gets the ball again. Layun is finding out. Oh, we have a beautiful run from Taylor. We have Harchin on the far post, and we should have a second goal. We, do. we are two goals up. Harchin scoring from close after a brilliant run from Taylor with a, just an amazing pass. Well done, Taylor. Well done, Harchin. So, Harchin scores his second goal in the championship. That's good, it's a good start. Two games, two goals. I mean, we are used to that from him. But I mean, you know, it's the championship. It's not League One and Two. So, things are getting tougher. But, I mean, he's an 82nd rated. He should be scoring like crazy wherever he plays. He's just a beast. So, <clears throat> we can just be happy. He is the, the MVP of this series. He is what we build the team around. So, and he's okay with that. Coming in with a oh, crossword. Get that one. Nice one. Arsenal scoring his third goal. And you see when he pulls away from his defender or his opponent, he just looks for free space and he just get the ball to him when he do that because he's gonna score. That's just how it is. That's he's just that good. Give him the ball when he's free and it's gonna be a goal. Poor defender. They can't leave him all alone in the box like that, with that space. You know? Shelton Skipper is just... I don't know what he's trying to moonwalk around. Can't do that. Hop on your toes, boy. So they are kicking off three goals. Or three goal lead, I should say, and we forgot to... I need to make the substitution because I'm talking to him. That's just an open ice hit from my player. Just tackled that guy in the back. And the referee was like, yeah, play on. And we should have gotten any other cards. But we didn't. Uh, I guess that's how we play now. We play ugly and dirty, and we are having a two lead instead because we can't catch him sometimes. This was one of those times. He's almost in his goalkeeper's lap, but not in the center of the box. He's way off. Out of position, and then. Not gonna compare. Not gonna compare. He actually tackled me in that situation. I wasn't really prepared. It's a game. We win. Three goals to one. So we started this adventure with two wins. Let's just enjoy that. Because things are going to get tough. But we have a pretty solid team. So this, if we keep this type of play up, it's going to be an interesting season. I uh, just hope we can stay in. If we get to be in the top, that would be amazing. Sniffing for Premier League. Okori scores, Harson scored twice. We win three goals to one. I'll take that.
two of them. The second game of this episode, we're gonna take on Blackpool in the EFL Cup. So, we are playing a, a cup which is beautiful. We get to, to try a few new players. Let's get the real team that I'm gonna play with. This one. <clears throat> we're gonna have the new keeper Fosher in goal. Sugiyama will be left back. Delaya will be uh, central back with McIntosh and Saya. We have Wooly as a right back. We got Yanev, central defensive midfielder. Ayadama in front of him. Clayton on the left wing. We got Whitehouse on the right wing. And we got Belkour up on top. And on the bench, we have a bunch of what used to be glitched players that are now not glitched and have potential. We're going to go to the Bloomfield Road or Bloomfield Road, I should say. We expect rain as the forecast and uh, let's head into the game. Buckle up. Let's go. They start with the cup. That's great. Honey's your speed. He needs the long legs. Beautiful. You are two. You can pass. And we have a beautiful save. We almost saw the first goal from Belkou. It doesn't really get the best. He has, <coughs> he has been put on the long list. Since Parkin entered the team, um, Ray was sold. And the reason why Janu is also on the on loan list is because we have Falk, the Swedish striker. And Janu is beautiful, done. Uh, but, uh, sorry, Janu is the Swedish uh, central defense midfield. So either Janu or, or Falk will go out on, on loan. One will play. Research and all that, and so I put both of them. But that was a beautiful attempt from Yana. Look at this nice run, one touch, find the far post, goal. Beautiful. Maybe Yana is the one to stay. We send Falk out to know. What do you think? Let me know. So, the Carabao Cup. The we are actually in the lead, which we, we never used to be. So, well, Macintosh almost did a really beautiful uh, interception there, but he gave it back. Nice one. Beautiful Falcher. The new keeper Falcher that we got from the free agency. He has been alright. Suguyama, he is actually transfer listed. That would be something rated and, and the one I have from the academy. Oh, that's close. The one I have from the academy is a 63 rated. I will go with them, the academy player. I'm, I'm going to try and face out the, the free agents I've been getting. Oh well. We are closing up and getting substitutions. Wow. That's a save at what a shot. Look at this. Overhead kick. Keeper. Yeah, I guess he was surprised because there was a body between the, the shooter and him. So he didn't see the ball until late. We're making three substitutions now. We're going to bring on. Um, <coughs> Both from Calder and Gray, all three from the academy, all three have been glitched, are now fixed. So welcome to the club, they're making their debut. Beautiful Gray, and you can set out your right midfielder, making him a right winger. Um, 64 rated right now. Oh, that, that. That wasn't his fault, that was actually really clumsy for me. But let's be quiet. Suriyama. Oh, he get the run, 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 run. 
We have plays inside the box. And we have a corner. I like that we are on this side of the field for once. It's a good attempt, but he gets no power at all. And keeper can easily just push it outside of the post. Oh, there's 30 seconds. That's how it's going to be the last thing that happens again. Either you're going to score, or we are beautiful. We will get rid of it. We are through to the next round. One goal to zero win away against Blackpool. It wasn't pretty, but we're through. Rotated side did a good job. They did a good job. Vasco Yana, the goal scorer. I'll take it. So we are ready for the third game of this episode. We're going to take on Queen's Park Rangers home at the House of Silly at the beach. Uh, it's overcast and uh, it's going to be interesting to, to play Queen's Park. Um, uh, I myself have been a Hoops fan since 1987, so it's a while. <clears throat> so it's going to be it's going to be mixed feelings to, to try and beat them. But without further ado, we're heading into the game. So buckle up. Let's go. So they start with a kickoff and game is on. Come on boys. This is going to be tough, but it's not impossible. Parker, he has done really well since he came into well, he came back to the team, I should say. He has been with us before. If any of you didn't know, he was well we brought him up from the academy a while ago. And he was he has the potential to be special. So now we actually lost potential uh, when we brought him back from Sheffield uh, United. So that sucks, but I think if we're gonna play him, um, he's gonna play as much as possible in the first team. And uh, I think by doing that, he might get his potential back. That was that was tough sometimes. Get that. You get that one? Come on, come on. That's the ball. It's an outside. No? Yep. Leon. Taking a shot. Not that far away, actually. <coughs> it's not that he took the shot. He just saw the ball coming. Come on, boys, and get back, parking. No, I'm walking back. That's. He is. If he gets injured, I'm gonna cry. Beautiful storm. We have Wells in the wing. Can we get to him? We have Leon in the center. We can get to him, and we have Hartson. I don't have. Yeah, he doesn't have an injury, which is beautiful. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly like to enjoy. Oh, come on. And uh, I think we might need that. <coughs> Roll. Finds Eadama. Can you go for a wing when White has standing? Coming with the crop. Oh, that's, that's a penalty. Okay. And Hodgson is red carded, so he can't take the penalty. That did look like diving, but you know. Let's see, 73rd minute. <coughs> Yadama. No, sorry, Belcourt. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Belcourt. You know you got the skills. Let's see. Belcourt scores. Penalty. We're man down, but we're goal up. Take that. He's cold as ice. Sends the, the keeper the wrong way and he just plays the ball. That's beautiful. Nice one, Bukur. Nice one. He does his first goal in the championship. Isaac Bukur. One goal in three games. Well, 
that's good. Maybe he can, you know, play well in the next game when Hodgson is actually suspended. He's going to need to step up, that's for sure. Oh, come on. Get up on the toes. Don't let them come in with a cross. Don't let them come in with a cross. Don't get them on the penalty because that's... <clears throat> they're going to... Beautiful Wells. Hold on. Oh, thanks. We win really one goal to zero. We have Hodgson's red card. And we still manage to win, that's... Well, that's good. I'll take that, definitely. Belcourt scores his first goal in the championship, giving us the win, the three points, home against Queen's Park Rangers. That's beautiful. That's just beautiful. I'll take this, look at that. Penalty 73rd, thank you. The fourth and final game of this episode, we're taking Blackburn Rovers away and we're gonna go to Ewood Park and fight them in the rain. So we are going with the first team, of course, but with a slight difference because we have our, well, we have the legend suspended. Hodgson is, is red card in the last game. Meaning he's suspended for this one, so Belcour, who's actually scored on penalty in the last game, gave us the three points. Actually, gonna start this one, helping us to get three points away against Blackburn Rovers. That's that's gonna be a tough challenge, definitely. Uh, but that's what we're gonna try and do. We are sitting, you know, in the top. We are actually sitting second in the league. We're gonna have a look at the league table after this game, but. Unless we lose this one big time, uh, it's actually looking pretty decent when it comes to the league placement. Um, I'm more than happy, to be honest. But without further ado, let's take on Blackburn Rovers away. Let's go to Ewood Park. Let's give them hell on earth and let's get away with three points. Buckle up. Let's go. So they have the kickoff and the game is on. Come on, Belcour. I know you have a game. A red card, then that tackle that Okori did should have been a blue or something. Oh, beautiful stone. So that's a yellow card. Yeah, I'll take it. That is a yellow card. I mean, he's a little bit. Look at this. Oh, okay. Face there. Okay, we can find Leon. <coughs> find him. Oh, come on, look cool. I don't know what feet you got. Okay, left to right foot, that's a beautiful shot. But let's say you're a right foot. Left foot, it's all right. Tackle. Leon, perfect run. Taking the shot. And we have a goal. Leon finds the bottom corner with a well placed and really hard shot. We're a goal up. On the road, beautiful. So Leon scores his second goal, and uh, in this, I think it's fourth game, and that's good. I mean, he's the central attacking midfielder, and we we want to get Bullock back, of course. Come on, take. Nice one. He stepped over that old. Beautiful run. Taking the shot. Very cool. He's stepping up. We needed that. We are two goals up. Very cool scores his second game this season. Second goal this season. Look, that's a nice finish. That's hard shot style. And we are so far away from our offense so they can turn around with the ball on the control and, and beautiful thank you, stuff. you know we are too far away we're giving them too much space too much time they can aim they can you know, pull the trigger and we we have to step our game up or else this is going to be a loss beautiful and then Rayun is getting killed the referee standing next to him and he's like, no, didn't see nothing. 
Oh, that should have been a, a free kick for sure. So there's a new corner. Oh, referee, what's wrong with you? It enters. He triggered this one. Nice. Oh. McBride gets the ball, of course, we give him the ball. We have a new corner and we are under extreme pressure. We're in the 60th minute, so it's half an hour to kill. We two go up, but not for long. And we have stolen the Superman in goal. Look at that. He actually gets a really nice head on it and he just, with the tip of his pinky finger, he pulls, you know. That's amazing. That is just amazing. They're gonna go short, uh, which is beautiful, because it gives us a little chance to breathe, but nope. Come on, Wells. Can you find Clayton on the wing? He can. And Clayton, can you have some speed? Yeah, I see you, Taylor, on the wing. And then we cut back on taking the shot. <laughs> no. Going for parking, parking turns around and he's getting cut down from behind. And it's the second yellow and he's such a, yeah, enjoy the shower. Look at that. What am I? Look at us. Uh, fresh lazy jumps in substitution. And he has, oh my god, he is actually doing a great run. And he's giving Belcour a beautiful pass. We have three goals to zero. Gray finds Belcour with a nice pass, that's a beautiful run, and Belcour scores a second, telling us that, yeah, I'm big enough to fill the shoes of Harshi, definitely. Fill the shoes. That is, that is nice, you know? We need to know that. <clears throat> Baku scores his third goal of the season. Oh, nice one, Will. Come on, yes, fly by, fly by. Can we have a, a replay now? We have movement inside the box. We can't even really get them. Gray was interested in scoring. We are six minutes overtime and we have played that. So we have overtime of the overtime. We come in with the corner. Can we do something? We can, but the roll doesn't get any power in the head that we have. Won the game, three goes to sale away. And things are looking really good to be honest. I think we have built a team. I think we have built a really good team. To be honest, look at this. Isaac Bakur, two goals. We win. I can't ask for more, you know? Leon scores as well. We have the three points away. Let's have a look at the league table. So, this is it. After four games in the league play, we are sitting first. 12 points, four wins in four games. Nine goals scored and one conceded, giving us a plus eight. Now, th this is just, I mean, look at this. This is beautiful. Now, we won four games in a row. That's just amazing. Uh, we have started really, really, really well. And uh, it's good to see that we actually win the game uh, like the last one when we had to. When we had Harshan suspended, we actually have a, another guy, Belcourt, who can actually score goals. That's beautiful, because we haven't had a second striker that could actually score. We had, they have been playing pretty decent, but they don't have that sharpness. They don't have that Harshan-ness. Uh, but now we have two. And I'm really happy about that, because if we're going to keep this up, <clears throat> we're going to push for Premier League, of course. I think we could be like a... a, a team fighting for you know the relegation battle in Premier League with like the team that we have right now we we could I mean we could get relegated but we could also like manage to stay there you know 
we are sitting first it's looking beautiful and the first game of the next episode is going to be us playing against Birmingham and we all know FM Lama is going to be torn he's going to be torn but that's how it is I want to thank you guys for watching this one I hope you guys stay safe stay healthy that you're kind to each other and I will see you in the next episode but till then one love walk good